Well, this next story is uh, coming to us from Liao Ning TV, and it is talking about the city of Shanghai's um, environmental watchdogs seeming to be uh, telling people not to buy monkeys. Now, the article goes on to say that the city's wildlife protection watchdog has warned that a man who claimed online to have bought a tiny monkey in Shanghai and raised it as a pet is risking a criminal charge for trading in protected wildlife. The Shanghai Wildlife Conservation Management Station said trading protected monkeys is a crime that could lead to five or more years in prison. The watchdog is seeking clues from the public to help track down the monkey owner and the related business chains. Photos of the home-raised monkey have spurred great online interest over the past couple of days, with some web users showing their envy discussing how to raise one of their own. The pictures show the palm-sized animal in various poses, including a popular one of the monkey sipping coke through a straw at a KFC restaurant. The owner described the animal as a Japanese stone monkey and said that he bought it for around 15,000 renminbi last month in Shanghai. He claimed that it's the only monkey breed authorized to be raised as a pet in China and that it will remain mini-sized after it matures. However, the Wildlife Conservation Station has said that the pet appeared to be a baby macaca, which is a precious species under national protection and banned from trading. Station officials have said that it's illegal to raise a macaca and that Training it is a crime. They also went on to say that it can grow to be 11 kilos. Well, if this uh, environmental protection um, authority is correct, then that monkey owner will probably have a monkey-sized problem on his hands in the next couple of years.